All right, number one, continuing with this three across four polyrhythm. But, uh, following those drums, as you may have already heard, they changed halfway through. Yes, indeed. So hopefully hearing less kick drum will actually make it easier for you to lock into what this rhythm truly is, just to make sure you get more solid with it before we completely move on from it. Okay, so here we go, starting at old 60. So one and a two and a three and a four and a one, two, three, four, 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 one, two, one, two, three, four, 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 one, two, three, four. All right, 120. One and a two and a three and a four and a one. Go back to 160 for those repeats. One, two, one and a two and a three and a four and a one. Change, bad core change. One and the two and a three and a four and a one and the two and a three and a four and a one. tough one okay number two I'm gonna stay the same rhythm throughout or uh well yeah it stays the same rhythm throughout but uh 140 is our maximum goal no faster than 140 just gotta change the setting here there we go okay so working it up, you can do it without the repeat. 
use Guitar Pro's percentage feature, you know, start at 50%, then get it at 60, then 70, and so on. But yeah, just being able to play the whole thing comfortably, accurately at 140, that is the goal. So let's play it here at uh, 70 beats per minute. And then 140 with the repeat. So 70 without the repeat, 140 with the repeats. One and a two and a three and a four and a... with the repeat one two one two three four Okay, number three. Building this one up, seeing where you can get. And no speed limit on this one. Just got to keep it accurate. All right, 60. One, two, three, four. Pick the string. One, two, three, four. Hundred twenty. One, two, three, four. Questions come up, let me know. I will see you again next week.